Hey everybody, my Britain here for Yeeland. Uh, it's October 13th today, Saturday. Um, it's going to be a big day today. We are going to have the roof uh, finished, done, and we're going to be cutting open the back of the trailer to go into the, uh, the mud room so that all that heat from the wood stove can, uh, can flow through the trailer. Because last night it was about minus two, um, minus six with the wind chill. So a little brisk when we woke up, but get that fire going right away and then it takes care of that problem pretty quick. So um, yeah, so a pretty big day. We're excited. Uh, the roof's going to be done. Uh, the mud room is going to be pretty much finished. It's going to be opened up. And then all we got to do is just put on a door and uh, go from there. So it's going to be pretty nice because I think we're going to be done work in the next couple days. Probably going to have maybe three, three days to enjoy ourselves. And, been up here for uh, the whole trip will probably end up being about 19 or 20 days and um, we haven't really done much fishing really done any of that so it'll be nice to just not have to worry about getting anything done and uh, just being able to enjoy ourselves so yeah stay tuned to the video today and see us wrap up the work thanks for watching Hey everybody, Matt Britton here up at Yeeland. It's uh, October 15th today, and as you can see, snow. It's not too, too bad. It could be worse. It's actually kind of nice to see. But uh, back home, we don't get snow this early, that's that's for sure. Not nowhere close to this. Maybe a month from now, mid-November, we'd get this kind of weather, but that's what, uh, that's what an 8 to 10 hour drive will get you. So, so today, anyways, we're working on the, um, the lean-to on the front of the mudroom extension um, so we can have our wood under there and get it out of the snow and get it out of the rain if it, it changes to that so um, yeah busy day that should only take about an hour to get that thrown up it's just three boards we got the main frame uh, outside frame and posts um, done for that so um, yeah we're just gonna throw that up so we have a nice dry spot to cut wood stack wood and then we're going to put the floor in, in the uh, mud room. Uh, we're going to lift the wood stove for that. And then um, get that finished and then get the door built. And we've got a couple of small jobs, uh, a couple 2x4s here, a couple pieces of metal there. And then that's, uh, that's pretty much it for the work. So we're going to have the rest of the week um, to enjoy ourselves. There's some uh, grouse hunting. Definitely going to make our way to the Metogamy River to do some fishing, get out in the canoe, do some fishing. So, 
working for basically over two weeks now and haven't really had much time to enjoy ourselves but at the same time um, the groundwork and the base is going to be set up now that you can come up any time of the year you can come up in the winter and uh, and have a camp out and enjoy yourself so this is laying the ground for the future future enjoyment and uh, it's been an enjoyable process you know it's uh, taken a little longer but We've also got a better setup and uh, you know a fully functional trailer now. Um, wood stove for keeping it nice and warm. Don't have to run the generators because we have our two batteries so uh, that we charge with the solar and with the battery charger. So we have that. It actually runs a blower off the the stove for that. So it's actually um, pretty exciting that we have all this set up now and uh, be able to enjoy it. So. Yeah, you can see how the finishing touches and then hopefully uh, see some wildlife. Thanks for tuning in and uh, hope you enjoy the footage. Yeah. Go. Don't pass. Yeah, go your way. <laughs> 